Our guardian star lost all his glow the day that I lost you. He lost all his glitter the day you said no, and his silver turned to blue. Like him, I am doubtful that your love is true. But if you decide to call on me, ask for Mr. Blue. I'm just kidding. We didn't talk about that. There's so many people that are going to do that so much better <laughs> later in the <laughs> evening. Um, and just so you all know, we've started our live stream. And for the live stream, my name is Maggie Rogers. My pronouns are she, her. And I'm the artistic director of Washington Ensemble Theater. <laughs> my name is Erin Bednars. My pronouns are she, her. And I am the producing director of Washington Ensemble Theater. Thank you for being here. And for all you on our live stream, we are coming to you from Block 41 in Seattle. Cut the sound. I'm joking. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, <laughs> coming to you from Block 41 in Seattle, which is on the uh, ancestral indigenous grounds of the Coast Salish, and that includes the Duwamish people. Uh, we recognize this in humility and move forward, knowing that this land acknowledgement means nothing without action and education. So, pay your rent. Yes. And if you're watching at home or you're curious here, please visit native-land.ca to see which indigenous land you reside on. And we have it memorized, so if you forget, just ask us later. And it's a, it's a Canada website. Somebody yeah. told me that. Um, oh. So, <laughs> ugh. So, Aaron, when was the last time we were here? Uh, like, right here? Yeah. Oh, probably February someday. That's either a teen or a 20 in 2020. And, like, that's the day we stepped into leadership and, like, nothing went wrong, right? Like, yeah. it was really smooth. There wasn't, like, a super traumatic global event that scarred us all for the rest of our lives and future generations. Yeah, I'm, I'm really well-rested. Mm. <laughs> That's, I'm really proud of you. Yeah. I'm proud of you too, dude. Dude, stop. Why are you so far away from me? I know, sorry. I'm like <laughs> socially distant. I love They're you. They're like, we, we can't get you in the same frame. Um, 
thank you all so much for being here. It's so exciting seeing so many amazing, smiling eyes. Can't see a lot of faces, that was a bad yeah. joke. And in all actuality, like, I can't stop telling people I love them, because I feel like I'm just like floating above my body. Uh, Maybe I, that's... I can't really tell if this is real life, but... It's probably on the molly you took before you came up here. Yeah, you're right, <laughs> you're right. Shh. Um, well, Aaron, yeah. I'd love for you to kick it off telling us about what we've been up to the past two years. I'd be happy to do that. You know, I think tonight is obviously uh, a community gathering. It's for us, but it's also for all of you. I think uh, I don't speak only for myself when I say it's been challenging to be able to connect with uh, our family, our friends, our community, our loved ones over the last two years. Uh, and so to be here and making eye contact with you all, um, I just stand here with a lot of pride, uh, a pride to share this evening with you and also pride to speak a little bit about Washington Ensemble Theater, which has really turned into be uh, my lifeblood since March of 2020. Uh, so just a little flash backward in case you don't remember. Uh, very quickly, I just wanna say a couple things that we were very proud to pull off during uh, 2020, 2021. Wow. Um, Give me a little holler if you remember a little program we did called Vote Art Vote. <laughs> yes, that was a, a curated, I would say, vignette style digital performance, AKA what the fuck are we gonna do now that we can't make plays anymore? Uh, that was co-curated by Raja Feather Kelly and Danny Tyrell, which we were very, very humbled to be able to participate with them and have them lend their genius to the Washington Ensemble Theater name. Uh, some of those performers you may see later this evening. So, you know, play a little match game, see what you remember. Um, I also want to take us, you know, probably a little bit further into the spring. Things are crazy. We like had to get our temperatures checked every day. Um, but we managed to commission a world premiere dance film called The Doll Pit. Uh, co-created by Maggie L. Rogers and one Sheridana Sinatra, who happens to be in Jody form this evening over in that corner, if you want to gawk a little bit or bow to her, which is usually what I end up doing. Um, and then another highlight that's really important for us to share um, is our attempt at a live installation piece uh, called Amber. Raise your hand or give me a hoot if you were able to catch that, able to check that out. So, um, co-created by Danny Terrell and Mark Heath Wiley. Um, and I just wanna bring those up for a second because it's really important for me to remember that while I feel like I'm in 2019 all over again standing on this stage, um, we also really worked our asses off to come up with something creative, something that wasn't live theater, uh, and we really challenged each other to find new forms, and we really, really did it for you all. Um, so thank you from the bottom of our hearts for sticking with us as we tried new things and got super weird and, you know, fought a little bit over Zoom calls for two years. Um, do you think I did it? Did I cover it? Yes. And we did a reset during that time, too. Not reset. What did we Six do? Six pack. <laughs> I swear to God, I'm the artistic director. Um, which is coming back again um, for our upcoming show, Tin Cat Shoes, by Trish Harnito, that I am directing. Um, thank you. Starring ensemble members Kiki Abba and Rachel Geyer Mafune. Mm. I don't know. They're pretty cool, right? Yeah. Well, um... We'll schmooze a little bit more about that later in the evening. Um, but if you all are ready, um, we have another performance to throw at you, if you're into it. Um, it is my very humble pleasure uh, to put you in the very capable hands of Munieka and Moonflower.
See, I was so overwhelmed, I forgot to turn my microphone on. Um, are you kidding me? Shocking. Um, I got a little ahead of myself, I want you to know, so I appreciate your hollering for Munique and Moo Flower, but um, I just, yeah, that was my bad. I just want to own up to that one. Cool. Um, you know, first live event in two years, people. Love you. Love you all. Um, Thank you so much. Um, so we're going to roll right into uh, a very special message from a very uh, dear friend of WETS, uh, Miss J. O'Leary Woods, uh, who, if you don't know, uh, was uh, very excitedly our director of a past production called B a couple years back. Um, thank you. Um, and just recently became uh, one of the artistic associate directors of the Fifth Avenue Theater. Moving on up, we love to see our friends growing and thriving. Um, and you know Jay, she's like, oh my God, I want to say some words about wet. I love you guys, I can't wait to be there. And then she goes, my husband surprised me with a trip to Mexico. And I was like, well, you better go on your trip to Mexico. Um, but she insisted that she find a way to share her words and her love and her adoration for this company with you all. Um, so we're going to get a little creative. Uh, and we have an audio message from Miss J herself. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and roll that message for you all. Um, and maybe we can just close our eyes if you want. You can stare at a beautiful picture of Jay if it comes up. It'll be great. And um, I just think that nobody, nobody really can say what she has to say about what but her. So i um, excited to hold a little space for Jay here in spirit. Hey, y'all. It's Jay Woods. I couldn't be happier to share a few words about this magnetic theater company. Washington Ensemble Theater is now old enough to vote, y'all. And here's what they're looking for from our community people who show up with bravery, just as WET has done since its inception. People who show up ready to sit in discomfort and have the willingness to explore that discomfort. People who believe in rebellious storytelling and the power of teamwork that makes WET possible. And that's what I admire most about this theater. They really are a tight unit of folks who care deeply for one another and continually celebrate each other's skills and provide space to invite others to tap into their vast potential. Despite the hell and high water that we all have been through, WET still managed to keep leaning into who they are and the hell they love to raise together. So let's raise those paddles to support their unyielding potential the sky is not the limit for these beautiful people doing the work the best that they can. And wouldn't you like to celebrate yourselves as supporting members of truly excellent theater? I know I do, and I won't ever stop. Cheers to Washington Ensemble Theater. We love... Whoa. 
We <laughs> it's funny that we called this the system failure gala because none of the tech is working. <laughs> um, we cursed ourselves. <laughs> um, but thank you so much, Jay. Hope you're having a killer time in Mexico. Um, and now I want to introduce somebody who's very close to the ensemble. Uh, we had her at our 2020 gala as our auctioneer, and we never want to do one without her. Oh, thanks, Mary. <laughs> Laura, do you want to come on oh, up? Thank you. Hello, everybody. <laughs> you know, um, it's been it's nice to be back. Um, it, it, I'm not sure that my family appreciated me being home for two years with all the talking that I do. You know what I mean? It was a mixed bag. But um, I read this article, maybe some of you had read it. Uh, it's kind of cliche to say I read this article in the New York Times, um, oh, about six months ago, about collective effervescence. Did you read that? And it was beautiful because it talks specifically about the energy that we have just sitting in this room together and how a lot of the introverts actually, even though it was kind of a high holiday when all this started, they were like, yeah. Um, they actually um, took a bigger hit because of this idea of collective effervescence. Because us, ex, you know, this, uh, us very social people figured out our ways. But I think the more quiet folks didn't have that energy to absorb. Does that make sense? So we're loving our introverts. I think they have a different idea about being an introvert, I suspect. But even if they don't, um, more importantly, we're all here together, so let's collectively effervescence ourselves for the next two hours or next hour. Um, we have a, a, a short but important live program, and then we have, um, within that, we'll have a ticket frenzy, and then, of course, we'll have a couple little performances and more conversation and then a raise the paddle. So um, we have big expectations because we're doing big things here at WET, right? And how fabulous. And I couldn't be happier to be with you, and I'm sure my family is very happy that I'm out of the house. So, yes. So, and Miss Maggie and, and darling Erin are here to move me along, and they'll read the items, and then we'll just go from there, okay? And so, can I just see all of your bid cards real quick? Thank you. If you can get them up in the air nice and high, and a reminder that I won't do the going once, twice, three times a lady kind of thing because we'll be here till midnight if I did that. And, and go ahead and turn off the middle wedge because I'm going to be in its way and it'll just feed back the whole night, if you don't mind. So I see you there. Yay! Okay, are you two, do you want a podium? Would that be more helpful? I feel great. Are right you here. okay? I feel good. Okay. I feel like I can... Exposed. I like that. Okay, ladybugs, I'm ready for you. What is our first... Is everybody ready for a live auction? Yeah. Isn't yeah. this something? Yeah. Cheers. All right. Our first item... It's going to be a round of champagne jello shots for your whole table. <laughs> this is a, a wet tradition that Sammy Dutzer used to have. And now our wonderful director of marketing, not marketing, development, system failure again. There's a gas leak in here. Our director of development. <laughs> <laughs> blue like Minnesota. All right, blue, yeah, work it, Ben. Mother of the bride over here. <laughs> yeah, show, show them your stuff. Okay. Nice. And so there's champagne jello shots. And um, I realized we didn't do a last call on the raffle ticket, so we'll do that next after the jello shots to kind of get us warmed up a little bit. Okay? So the value may be a million dollars, but whatever. We'll start out a little bit lower here tonight at WET. And stay up there and sh sh give me a little jello shake there. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Watch it, okay? Okay, here we go. Who, and then when you uh, buy it, you can suck all the jello down yourself or share it with your table, which is a generous thing to do. So here we go. Suck or share, you know what I mean? Who would like to start us out? What about 100? One, one and a quarter, one and a half, 75, now two. Two, 25, 50 here, 75, three, three and a quarter here, 50, 75, 400, now five. Queenie, five, right there. Now five and a half, able to give me 550. Sammy over there at five and a half, five, 550 here, nice. Five and a half here, now six. What about six? Able to give me six, bitter to buy them at six, 550 here, 575. Able to give me 75, bitter to buy them at 75. Shall I sell this then for 550? Right there. Sold, $550, beautifully done. Bitter one, three, seven, one, three, seven. Sammy, Sammy, can I, can I sell you a second round for 550? Sammy, Sammy, Sam, it behooves you. 
Sammy, Sammy, Sam. One, two, two. What? Sammy, you hired me two years ago. Look at me. What a, what a turncoat I am. <laughs> Nicely done. I was in the vintage furniture business and in the decorative arts business, and I still do that. But um, Jean Jong Award is a famous, you know that taupey thing we have going on in the Northwest? Do you know that aesthetic we have? It's kind of taupey and a little has a little Japanese influence and cedar. That's Jean Jong Award, and she actually Ooh. did the interiors for the Inna Langley. She did. Which I didn't know until I went there, and I said, this is Jean's territory. I didn't so, know until you just told me. So, <laughs> And if you care about those things, it's kind of fun because it's very soothing. So this is valued at about $1,200, um, a little uh, two-night stay. You can extend your visit as well. And then um, tickets to the cinema, the theater, or the, the movie theater, excuse me, mm -hmm. and uh, <laughs> complimentary breakfast. So here we go. Or go yourself. You know, leave everybody at home. And dogs are allowed. Dogs are allowed. Which is important. Only dog children. You and your doggies. Okay, here we go. Who would like to start us out? What about 500? A, able to give me five. Better to bet me five over here. Now seven and a half. A, able to give me a thousand here. Now 12 and a half. 1500. A, able to give me 15. Better to bet me 15. A, able to give me 15. Hey, sister, what about 15? I have you, sir, at 1250. Hang tight at 12 and a half here. What about 1350? A, able to give me 13 and a half. This money right here to wet, you see? That's where it's going, right here. Sir, I have you at 12 and a half. I think he might come in at 15 if I can get 13.50 here. Are you able to give me 13 and a half? Shall I sell this then for 12.50? No pressure, just looking at you. <laughs> so, again, people are glad I'm out of the house. Nicely done, I'm glad. I anticipated that, but sometimes I could be wrong. And then I got that like, like little cartoon character sweat bullet coming off. 15 here, what about 17.50 now? Are you able to give me 17 and a half? A, able to give me 1750 15 here 16 what about 16 able to give me 16 i'll sell this then for fifteen hundred dollars nicely done sold fifteen hundred dollars thank you lincoln thank you Yay, lincoln. lincoln 189 189 what a nice name beautiful thank you ladies nicely done and how about a hand for our other bidders yeah thank and gene john no, award you. i mean who cares about gene john award but whatever <laughs> she's long gone she'll be happy i mentioned her name Okay, here we go. <gasps> Ooh. All right. Our third item is the beloved wet yes. pinata. All right, we can bring this bad boy up here tonight. I also, I have to be a little embarrassing and tell you all that your pinata model is my younger brother. Woo! Oh, Frank. So, you know, whether you bid on the pinata or bid on the pinata holder, it's a win-win situation. And our system failure. And our pinata has a secret surprise inside. Tell us about it, Maggie. Tell us. I don't know. It's a secret. But what other? Well, okay. So <laughs> I can do but, it. But, I'll, or, I'll I'll loosen or my lips. Just give a little teaser, and then the <laughs> yeah. value is. The value is pretty pretty good. Uh, I have an inkling that some of you might enjoy three course dinners for four people. Oh. Maybe you're interested in that. Maybe you're interested in some limited edition bottles of wine. Ooh. Maybe you're interested in smashing the shit out of something. Yes! <laughs> yes. That's the winner right there as mm -hmm. far as I'm concerned. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, my sheet does not say my fair market value, Laura. Well, guess I, fair market value is just shy of $700. All right. Okay. So you are going to come up immediate. That's immediate gratification. Smashing the pinata till the cows come home. So who would like to start with all the beautiful accoutrements falling out? Mm -hmm. Okay. So who would like to start us out? Lincoln? Just checking. Two and a half here. Three able to give me three and a half here. Now four. What about 450 now? Able to give me four and a half. Valued at 700. Four right here. Now 450. Excellent. Where's my 450 at there? I see you at 450 here. What about five? Thank you, sir. Five over here. Now five and a half. Able to give me 550. What about five and a half? Smashing the shit out of the pinata. I've got five over here. Now five and a half. Able to give me five and a half. What about 550? Hey, sister, what about 550 now? What, what about a, a package from Babeland oh. in addition? Yay! A million dollars! We're putting the swing 
in the swingers package. Five and a half here. What about six? Able to give me six here. What about six? Be there to buy me six. Able to give me six. What about five seventy-five? Fifty here. Seventy-five. Able to give me five seventy-five. Three quarters. Wine dinner. Anybody else in? Smashing the pinata. What are you gonna go home and smash? Nice. Seventy-five here. Thank you, sweetheart. Five seventy-five. What about six? Eh? Able to give me six. Better to buy me six. I see you, sir. Nicely done. Six right here. Now seven, sir. What about seven? Toys and Babeland right here at seven. Able to give me seven. Better to buy me seven. Beautiful. Now eight, sir. What about eight? Eh? Able to give me eight. Better to buy me eight. Able to. The tax write-off is past fair market value. Just helping you out. Nice. Eight over here. What about nine? Able to give me nine, sir. What about nine? What about eight and a half? Able to give me 850 right here? Eight and a half. Excellent. Now 900 here. It might be yours at nine. Eight and a half, now nine. Able to give me nine. What about nine? I wish I had a toy from Toys and Babeland right here. Able to give me nine. See, it's going there. Nine right here. <laughs> Throwing dildos around the room. Wouldn't that be something? My next life. Nine over here. What about $1,000, sir? Able to give me a grand. What about 1000 for wet? Speaking of. 950. Able to give me nine and a half? I'll sell this then for nine hundred dollars. Nicely done. Sold nine hundred dollars. Beautifully done. Thank you, sir. Thank you. That's one sixty-one, Aaron. One sixty-one. Do you have the thank you? You need the thank you. You don't have the thank you bitter list? No. Okay. I'll give it to you. Okay, here we go. Get out of the way. Ah shit. Smash it, smash it, oh! guest here just won. Do you see what it is? Do you see what you got? What does it say? It's a Cantonetta restaurant group and Passing Time Winery. Nice. Bring it on. Open the bag. I want to see what's in the bag. Can we get a little wave from our Cantonetta okay. family over there? It's private. Jeez. Thank you. Yay. Nicely done. Thank you for your generous donation. And how generous of our restaurants, who really, um, it's been a burden to say that lightly. It's yes. It's been very, very difficult. So we're grateful that you jumped in and supported us. So thank you for your beautiful food. Thank you, sir, for your pinata swinging style, batting away, breaking the pinata. We appreciate you. So what we have next, fine women, is uh, our ticket frenzy, number one. So this is how this works. Very quick, the ticket frenzy. You raise your paddle, I sell it like it's speed dating, kind of. Do they still do that speed dating? Good. That's good that you don't know. Probably, no? Oh, it's, yeah, that's right. No, speed, <laughs> no dating during COVID or speed dating. Okay, so here we go. Tell it. So Miss Maggie's going to read them quickly, and I'm just going to, and Mag, go ahead and say what it is, and yep. then say the amount, and I'll just sell them real quick, okay? All right. The 1448 Projects. Two tickets. $50. Hey, able to give me 50. What about 50? Hey, able to give me 50. First paddle up. Sold. Better 181. Next. Next act theater. Two tickets to the thin place. $138. Yeah, 138. Able to give me 138. Better to buy me at 138. 138 here. What about 150? Hey, able to give me one and a half. Better to buy me at one and a half. Sold. 138. Better 139. Next. All right. Another act theater. Two tickets to any main stage show. 138. Hey, able to give me 150, sir. Is that Okay, Stephen, thank you. 150 here, I'd like to round it up. How presumptuous. What about 160 here and now 70? Sir, what about 170? Able to give me 70, better to bet at 70? Shall I sell this then for 160? 70 here, now 80. Able to give me 180, now 90. What about 190? I've got it over there, now 90, sir. Are you out? So 180, bidder number 132. Thank you kindly. Next, Maggie. All right, Arts West Playhouse. Two ticket to This Girl Laughs, This Girl Cries, This Girl Does Nothing, $88. $88. Able to give me 88. What about 100? Able to give me one bidder to buy me 100? Able to give me 100? Sold to Steven for $88. Bidder number 184. Thank you. All right, Book It Repertory Theater. Two tickets, $100 to Bonesetter's Daughter. Oh, Bone Setter's Daughter, $100. Able to give me one bidder to buy me. We're supporting theater in all its forms here. One over here now, one and a quarter. What about 125? Shall I sell this then for $100? One and a quarter here. Are you in at 125? Is that okay? Okay. 
What about 150 now? Are you able to give me one and a half? Excellent. 75 here, able to give me 175? Sold. 150, bidder number right here, ma'am. Thank you. 181. All right. Next up, Burke Museum. Four guest passes, $88. And let us know when we have about two left. Great. 88, are you able to give me 88 right here? What about 100, are you able to give me 100? Bitter to bam at 100, able? You look at fossils and things like that. 88 over here, now 100. What a, and great architecture. I'll sell this to you, sir, then, for $88. Thank you kindly, Bitter. 192, next. Cafe Nordo, two tickets to Down the Rabbit Hole. $200. Oh, 200, eh? able to give me two? I see you, sir. Two and a quarter here now, is that okay? What about two and a half? Eh? Able to give me 250 here, 250 there, 75, 75 here. What about three, sir? Eh? Able to give me three now, three and a quarter, eh? able to give me 325? 300 here, a quarter now, eh? able to give me three and a quarter one more time at 325 right here for wet, sir? Three here, quarter here. Look at me for approval, not the person next to you. <laughs> That's something, how presumptuous of me. Shall I sell this then for 300? 25 now, beautiful. What about 350? It might be yours at three and a half, so 350 here, a quarter here, half here, are you able to give me three and a half? For wet, isn't that something? Three and a half here, now 75. Are you able to give me 375? I'll sell this then for 350, thank you, sir. Better 192. All right, next. Capitol Hill Block Party, pair of three-day passes, oh. $400. $400, a pair of three-day passes. What about 200, eh? able to give me two, bitter to bam two, eh? able to give me two, two here now, two and a quarter, eh? able to give me 225, maybe a drunk fest, I'm not sure. 225, 250, 75, three over here, three and a quarter, eh? able to give me 325, three right here, sir, three here, spotter, I've got 300 right here. What about three and a quarter now? I'll go ahead and sell these, this pair, oh, three and a quarter, now 400, eh? able to give me four, what about four, bitter to bam at four, eh? able to give me four, raising money for wet right here. Then you go to the Capitol Hill, Block party at 400, three and a quarter over here, now four, 50, 350 now, 350 in, nice. 75 here, 375, now 400, back to you, sir, at 400. Shall I sell this then for 375? Can I see right there? Nicely done, 400, better 179, sold, $400. Beautiful. <laughs> Next. Dodge Theater, two tickets to any show, $76. $76. 76 here, what about 90? Able to give me 90, bitter to bet 90, able to give me 90? 90 right there, I see you at 90 over here. Ma'am, what about 100? 100 right here, able to give me 100, our performance artist right there, nicely done. 110, able to give me 110, bitter to bet 110, I've got 100 here, sold, $100 to you, sister. Bitter number right here. Right in front of you, Kiki, thank you. 187, nicely done. How many do we have left, Miss Meg? All right, we have three more left okay. on side A. Here we go. All right, next up, Intamon Theater, two tickets to Two Mile Hollow, $130. Oh, 130, eh? able to give me 130, bitter to bam at 130, thank you, Stephen. 130 here, now 140, eh? able to give me 140. Anybody else in? I'll sell this then to Mr. Stephen for 130, who loves wet, I might add. Sold, bitter number 184 for $130. <laughs> All right, Museum of Pop Culture, four tickets, $100. $100, hey, able to give me one over here now, one and a quarter, able to give me 125, I see you at 125, 50 here, sir, thank you. 75 now, hey, able to give me 175, 50, 75, 200 here, two and a quarter, what about 225? I'll sell these then for $200, nicely done. 225, one more time, beautiful, 50 now. Hey, able to give me 250, I'll sell these then for 225, nicely done, sister, may I see your bidder number? For 225, 142, thank you. Thank you to my other bidders. Nice, gentlemen. All right, last one on this, this side. This is it. On the boards, too many subscriptions. Pick any three shows, $150. Another great organization, all yep. of these organizations. Oh, yeah. What about one and a half? Are you able to give me one and a half? I see you, ma'am, now 75. Are you able to give me 175? I'll sell this then for 150 on the boards at 175. Your choice, any shows you want, I'll sell this then. A pair of passes for 150. Nicely done. So, bitter 149. 149. Yay for the frenzy! Yay! Things Thank you. are feeling frenzy. A frenzy indeed. <laughs> How about a round of applause for all of you? Thank you. You're here, you haven't left. We have tickets to see things in person I again, know. Laura. I'm just so excited. It's so insane. I think, I think it's, we're, we're in a, the sun, I see the sun, I see the rainbow. Yes. Everything's coming out. Right off of this <laughs> CD, this reflective CD. <laughs> Should I tell them about the next one? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so this one is near and dear to my heart. Um, this is a private dinner. We're talking private dinner. 
We're talking about oh. Chef Roger Harper of Tavolata, who uh, happens to be sitting in the audience with us tonight. Where's he at? There you are. Woo. Oh, lucky us. We're talking about his uh, companion in life and in love and in restaurant and food joy, Sarah Peterson, our wine expert. Yay, Sarah. Yay, Sarah. Uh, Co-hosted by yours truly. Wonderful. A Monsieur. customizable eight-person private dinner from Chef Roger Harper and wine expert Sarah Peterson. Uh, I think it explains itself, honestly. What else is there to well, say? It's going to be at your house unless, of course, um, yes. you can go ahead and cut those wedges out because they're just terrible, if you don't mind. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank just you. Just to be honest with you. You know what I mean? We don't need a wedge action here. Yeah, we don't need it. No wedges. So but what we do need is a private dinner, <laughs> which you can have. Uh, you can have it at your house if you want to host. Otherwise, we can find a very... Uh, attractive and discreet location for you to host your dinner. I'm like happy to that. do that for you. A little discretion is good. So here's the deal. We have eight seats available, and if you want more than one seat, just raise your fingers, like, I want two tickets, that means you want two, with your bid card. So just give me a second, and I'm gonna have you two help me out once we shake it out, okay? Mm -hmm. You with me? So, and uh, hold on one second. Miss Erin, I have a quick question. Ask me. Right, okay, just double checking. Okay, so here we go. Eight tickets available at $250 each. Raise your paddle. Eight tickets available at a, at a date that will be determined for $250 each. Is anybody in? And if you don't put your fingers up, I know that you just want one. How's that? Thank you. 129 will take two, and guest 301 will take two. Thank you kindly. We have four more tickets available. Anybody else in? Thank you, Jacob Garcia. We want to sell all these tickets here because we're raising money for Thank WAC. Thank you, Jacob. Thank you, Carrie. And you got to, I'm not making the dinner. Does everybody understand that? Thank you, Stephen. 184. Thank you, Stephen. We'll take two. Yay, Stephen. Anybody else in? I have two tickets left. Last call. Anybody else in? I'm not going to leave until we sell these two, which is a terrible okay. thing. Okay. 167. Oh. One, hold on. 167. How many would you like? 167, do you want 2 2? Okay, well, hold on. So you're at 250. What about 275? Able to give me 275? Sold. 250 right here. Bitter number for two tickets. 167. Nicely done. Thank you, Sheila. <laughs> oh, Sheila. Okay. Now tell us, we have a little surprise something next, okay? Prick up your ears. Tell us what it is. Well, it's funny, you know, bitter 174 that you lost out on that dinner. Um, you know, if seats aren't your thing, if you don't like sitting at a table, uh, we have an exclusive, uh, what I like to call a co-host slash sous chef experience uh, for this dinner. So instead of being seated at the table, uh, we have up to two spots where you get to hang out with me, you get to the look chef. over Chef Roger Harper's shoulder and get cooking Sous advice, chef. give feedback. Uh, you'll also be sitting with Sarah and I to taste the wines, maybe give us your input. This is an immersive dinner experience. I know Sarah was telling me earlier, she was like, the amount of things I've learned by watching my husband cook is unreal. I love so, that. So we have two spots available. Who would like at least one spot for 250? Or how about this? Let's go ahead. Are you in a 250? Nice. Bitter 174 will take a spot. And we'll probably be able to give you a little chair or something, you know. Um, in the kitchen. <laughs> Don't get too excited. Okay. Anybody else in a 250? Another sous chef spot? Nicely done. Bitter 116. 116 at 250. I love that. Stretching you, it out. That's another $500 for wet. Beautifully done. All right. Thank you, Pete and Michael. Nice. Okay. Tell us what's next. Oh, this is exciting. All right. Go for it. All right. Next up. This is an exciting one. We have some Minnesotans in our ensemble. Um, and this is. Three nights for up to six people in Duluth, Minnesota. A condo stay on Look Lake Superior. I know. You can enjoy three nights. It's two bed, two bath, and it has a sauna. A sauna included. 
You'll also receive a selection of gift cards from some adorable restaurants in Duluth and the Minnesota North Shore painting to an, oh, and a Minnesota North, North Shore, system failure, North Shore <laughs> painting to enhance your trips. And it includes round trip tickets oh. to the Minneapolis airport. Nice. So, so here, Maggie. Yeah. So we can fly into Minneapolis, St. Paul, get in the car that we rent and drive like 150 miles to Duluth. Yeah, just cruise exactly. on over. And Duluth, or excuse me, Minnesota has the most lakes of any state in our country. Uh, the land 14,000 lakes. 14,000 lakes, including Lake Superior. The Got land that? of 10,000 lakes. This is exciting. And there it is. Look at our Ben over there in his Minnesota colors. That's okay. right. Ben, Minnesotan. And you too, Miss Erin. I didn't realize I that. I am. I am Minnesotan. Too much pride over here. So I have an absentee bidder here. I will let you know when they're out so you don't think I'm making things up. Do you know what I mean? That's kind of nice. Very little is illegal in what I do, but there's some things that are unethical. That would be one of them. <laughs> so here we go. Who would like to start us out? Valued at just shy of $2,000, including airfare. You can use the airfare somewhere else if you end up wanting to use your own yeah. tickets to get to Duluth or to Minneapolis-St. Paul. So I have an absentee bid at $500. Who would like to come in at seven and a half? Hey, able to give me 750 here? They're at 1,000. Absentee's at 1,000. What about 12 and a half? Stephen, what about 1250? Beautiful. I believe the absentee is out now. Let me double check. Nice. 12 and a half here. <laughs> what about 1,500? Hey, able to give me 15? Better to buy them at 15. Able to give me 15? 1250. What about 1350? Able to give me 13 and a half? I see you. Nice choice at 1350. Yeah. Nice. What about 1500, Stephen? Stephen, Stephen. On the Steven, beach, Steven, Lake Superior. Stephen. Betty White, Prince. Hey, able to give me 15. What about 15? Better to Bemmon. They're both dead, but you know, it's a thought. What about 15? <laughs> you just drive by. <laughs> what about 15? Hey, able to give me 15? One more time at 15. Are you in, Stephen? You've got dinner. Anybody else in at 15? Sister, you're still hanging tight right there, right? Okay, thirteen fifty, if I'm not mistaken, right? Three nights. Yes, fourteen. Three, three, three nights. What about fourteen? Fourteen fifty here. Fourteen fifty here. Sister, what about sixteen? Are you able to give me sixteen? What about sixteen hundred? This is one of my favorite things. Not that I'm expecting you to take me, but I think it's a wonderful mm. trip. Way to explore Minnesota. What about sixteen? Are you able to give me sixteen? We've got your dinner thing? covered. Your coffee's covered. Fifteen. Are you able to give me fifteen hundred? I'll sell this then to Stephen. Your 14, souvenirs 15. are covered. 15? Nice. 15 Woo! here. Stephen, are you out? I've got 15 over here. I'll sell this then for 15. And I was going to mention Al Franken, but that's probably not good either. I don't know. Okay, sold. $1,500. Woo! Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, sister. 134. 134. 134. Thank you, Stephen. Nicely done. Everybody I mentioned is dead or is in trouble, so just ignore me. Okay. <laughs> in trouble. So many people are in trouble all the time. <laughs> I'm sure I'll be in trouble by the end of the night. Okay. All right. This one is the one I'm the most excited about. Okay? Everybody listen up. Oh. This is... Next. Two tickets. To see Billie Eilish. Nice. Is that Billie Eilish up there? Uh, yeah, it's Billie Eilish up there, dog. How many Grammys does Billie Eilish have? A million. Uh, seven. <laughs> I don't know. Is this a, am I in trouble? <laughs> seven. seven. She has seven. <laughs> Love Billie Eilish. And these are two tickets to the Happier Than Ever World Tour at the Climate Pledge Arena on March 25th. Yes, coming up. Billie Eilish. And a little dinner, too, right? Yes. Com uh at uh, one of Renee Erickson's restaurants of your Ever choice. Ever heard of her? Sea Creatures Restaurant Group yep. people. So here we go, Billie Eilish and a little Sea Creatures Din Din, valued at just over $1,000. And if I'm not mistaken, it's affirmed here that the tickets are sold out. Absolutely, right? you cannot so get any. Here we Tonight. go, who would like to start us out? What about 500? Are you able to give me five? Better to buy at five. Are you able to give me five? Anybody at five? What about five? Maggie, what about five? I'm right over here. I see you at five right there. Billy Eilish, 500 here. What about seven and a half? Are you able to give me 750? Better to buy at seven and a half. And these are VIP 500 tickets. 500 here. What about 600? Are you able to give me six? Better to buy at six. Six here. Now 750 here. 750 here. Now $1,000. Are you able to give me a grand? What about 1,000 now? Yeah. Beautiful. 1,000 over here. Excellent. 
What about 12 and a half? Are you able to give me 12.50? What about 12 and a half? Are you able to give me 12.50? We're talking single digits. Stay seat with rows. my thousand over there. Stay with my thousand. What about 12 and a half, sir? 12.50 now. Are you able to give me 12 and a half? What about 12 and a half? What about 1100? Are you able to give me 11, Sold sister? What about 11? Out Just show. checking. I've got a grand over here. 1100. Yeah. You're at 1100? You're at 11 now? Is that okay? You were at 1,000 earlier, and if you want to bid against yourself because it's a fundraiser, that's okay. <laughs> so I've got you at 1,000 already, if I'm not mistaken. Isn't that right? They're at 1,000, yes? What about 11 now? Are you able to give me 11 bidder to bid at 11? Able to give me 11? I'll sell this then. Would you give me 1,100 and then I'll call it good? Nice. So yeah! bidder 116. 116 for $1,100. These look good. Thank you, Michael. I know. Thank you, Michael. How about a hand for our second and third highest bidders over here? Way to go, Woo. Billie Eilish. Isn't she like 15 or something? She's very I young. think she's basically like just yeah. turned 18. She just turned 18? I know. My God. I was a wreck when I was Ooh. 18. Yeah, I know. Slackers, we're all slackers. Still like a wreck. <laughs> <laughs> I do that all the time. Well, when I was 23, why can't that person do this? It's like, well, you were 23 in the 80s. It was different. Okay, so exactly. that's the excuse. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Another frenzy of sorts, A right? frenzy. I'm with you this time. Okay, sister. It's you and me. Another ticket frenzy. Miss Aaron's gonna throw them our way. Here we go. Oregon Shakespeare Festival. Two tickets to any show in the season, $150. Are you able to give me one and a half, 75 now, two, two and a quarter, 250 here. Stephen, what about two and a half? Are you able to give me two and a half? What about 250 now, 75? 250, 75, able to give me 275? Sold, 250. Beautifully done. Thank you, gentlemen. Bitters Thank you. 151. Thank you. Next. Thank you, David. Portland, Portland Center Stage, two ticket vouchers, $184. You can buy things while you're there and don't pay sales tax, which I like. Just don't tell your They're basically you free tickets in that yes. case. What about 150? Are you able to give me one and a half? Bitter to bet 50 here now, 75. Are you able to give me 175? Anybody else in? I'll solve these then for 150. Nicely done. Going to Portland. Sold. Bitter number. For $150, thank you, 139, 139. Thank, thank you, you, Aaron Johnson. Yeah. Nice. Seattle Aquarium, four guest passes, four guest passes, $120. Our local guy, 120, 130 here, not 140, sir, 150 here. Are you able to give me one and a half, what about 150? I've got 40, 50 here. I see you at 150 here, 175, thank you, sir. Now two, the Burke and then the Aquarium, isn't that something? 175 here, now two. Are you able to give me two, bitter to buy me two? I'll sell these then for 175. Thank you, local man. We appreciate you. Your bidder number is 192. Thank you. A friend of Lincoln. Thank you, <laughs> Lincoln's <laughs> table. All right, Seattle Opera. Two tickets to either Blue or Marriage of Figaro. $400. $400. Beautiful. I the see opera. you. Four over here. Now four and a quarter. Able to give me 425. I see you, sir. Now 450. Four and a half, 75. Able to give me 475. Now five. Five over here. Now five and a quarter. Able to give me 525. Five and a quarter now, sir. 525. Shall I sell these then for 500? Nicely done. Sold. $500. Woo. Thank you very much. Bidder number 167. 167. Thank you. Thank you again, Seattle Sheila. Public. Oh, I'm sorry. Say it again. Oh, no. Thank you again, Sheila. <laughs> Sheila. Yay, Seattle Sheila. Seattle Public Theater. Two tickets to Pipeline and two tickets to Riverwood. A hundred bucks. One hundred dollars. Able to give me a hundred. What about a hundred? Able to give me a hundred here. Now one and a quarter. Able to give me 125. Sold. A hundred dollars. Better. 181. Nicely done. Right. Seattle Thanks. Rep. Seattle Rep. Two tickets to Teenage Dick. A hundred and forty-eight dollars. I'm the sound designer. I'm just oh. going to say it. Yay! Worth a million! <laughs> a million dollars. Is it okay? Is it okay? Not so good? 150 then. Are you able to give me one and a half? Just teasing you. 150 here. 175. Are you able to give me 175? 50, 75. Now two. Are you able to give me two? Bitter to buy me two. 175 here. Sold. 175. Nicely done, sir. Bitter, if you can put your bitter number right in the air. Thank you, sir. Number 116. Thank you. Next. Thank you. Thank okay, you, Seattle Rep. Two tickets to any show in nice. the 21 22 season. 150 bucks. Are you able to give me one and a half? I think it's 22 23 season. I'm going to say it. Yeah. Stretch it out. <laughs> what about 100? Are you able to give me 100? What about $100? Thank you, Steven. Yeah. I can count on you. One over here. One and a quarter. What about 125? 125, 50 now. Steven, what about one and a half? One and a half here, 75. Are you able to give me 175? 
Sold to Stephen for 150, bidder 184. 184, thank you. Seattle Shakespeare Company, two tickets to Much Ado About Nothing. $88. 88, Are you able to give me 88. What about 100, one and a quarter, one and a half, 75? 175, is that okay? 175 here, now two. Are you able to give me two, bidder to Bama, two, sister, I think it's you at 175. Nicely done, sold, 175. Bidder 113. Yay, it's so nice to be with you. I might, st I might cry. Oh my God. You okay. and me both. Oof. I've got two left. Yes. So dry no, it I up. won't cry yet. Okay. <laughs> okay. I've been crying for Thank two you, years. Thank you, Catherine. I mean, what's the difference? Okay. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> okay. I'm ready. I love you. I okay. Love you too, sister. Sound Theater Company, two tickets to Gaslight, 50 bucks. $50. Able to give me 50. Now 60. Able to give me 60. Better to buy me at 60. Stevens here at 50. 60 here, 70, Stephen. Able to give me 70, what about 70? I see you. 70 over here, now 80. Able to give me 80? I'll sell these then for $70. Nicely done, sold, $70. Excellent. And your bid number, please. Thank you kindly, bidder number 166, thank you. Last one. This is it for the thank frenzy. Thank you, Tyler. Village Theater, two tickets to the season. Any, or for the whole season, it's two tickets. Quad, right? 144. Isn't that Issaquah Village? Or is Vill that Issaquah and Everett. Oh, and Everett. Yeah. North and East. 100, right? A what is the total again on that? 144. 144. How about one and a half? One and a half right there now, 75. Able to give me 175. Better to amendment 75. 50, 75. I see you right here. 170. It took a minute, but I see you. 175 now, two right there. Sister now, two and a quarter. Able to give me 225. Sir, two and a quarter here for wet. 225, 250, able to give me two and a half. You were dying for these earlier. Two and a quarter, two and a half right here for wet. I'll sell these then for 225. Nicely done. Sold. Better 190. Is that okay? <laughs> Lovely gentleman over here. 190. Thank you, thank you. Thank around? you again, Lincoln's table. Lincoln's table. Coming in hot. Yep. It's a good president. Okay. So how about a round of applause for our frenzy? Does anybody want a piece of candy? Keep looking at the Snicker bar. Keeps calling my yeah, name. Yeah, it's definitely okay. a tripping hazard. If anybody okay. wants some high chew. Tell us what's next. I'm going to get some of <laughs> we've, uh, we've got one final auction item oh. if you're up for it. What's up? Uh, so I don't know how many of you were able to join us at our 2020 gala, um, but at that gala, Chef Manu Alfau gave us some pretty delicious food. Uh, and oh, nice. Throughout the pandemic, he has actually turned over and started a whole new restaurant called Evergreen Pizza Company, uh, which is on the Kitsap Coast. And so we're working with Manu. We've got an Airbnb weekend and Kitsap Coast, right an there. An eight-guest group dinner at Evergreen Pizza Company. This is a thousand-dollar Airbnb gift card. Very nice. One G, one whole G. <laughs> Are you kidding? As we say in the Midwest. Well, yeah, that's what we say. I'll give you a grand. <laughs> I'll give you a grand. <laughs> grease their palm with a $1,000 bill. That's how we do business in the Midwest. So you got the gift card and you have a fairy picnic basket. You've got some wine. You've got some cards to play on the fairy. How picturesque is that shit? Oh, my God. And then <laughs> you have a group dinner for up to eight at Evergreen Pizza Company, which is bomb. It's so bomb. You would know, because he's your buddy. I would know. And I'll be there. I'll hang with you. I'll be there. So all kinds of things going on. A big company. The, I love the Kitsap Coast idea. Uh, the Airbnb. And hey, um, Michael Castor, where are you at? Where's Michael? Michael, you bought a trip last time. It was at Tahoe, in Tahoe, right? Did you go? <laughs> oh, because of COVID. Yeah, forget. Pretend. Anyway, make up for it right here. Just making a, just your little travel planner here, OK? So here we go, valued at, uh, well, fair market value is over $2,000, 2300 So this is our last live auction item, and then we're going to hear a little bit more about why we're here and then have a raise the paddle. Who would like to start us out? What about 500 eh? able to give me five, able to give me five, bitter to bam at five, now seven and a half, able to give me 750 What about $1,000? I see you at a grand right there, a grand. Did you catch that? 12 and a half, able to give me 1250 Beautiful. 12 and a half right here. 1500 Sister, what about 15 able to give me 15 The Airbnb is worth 1000 right there because you get gift cards. 
Isn't that nice? 15 here, 17.50. Able to give me 17 and a yeah. half. Beautifully done. Now 2,000. Able to give me two. two th the clapping. Keep 25. Oh, no. I'm going to talk to the sister here, if you don't mind. It's my nature. Not, not that there is an equality here. I'm just making sure. Two grand. Sister. 22.50. 22.50. You sure? 21. I'll just step away. No pressure. Hey, able to give me 21. What about 21? I see you at 2,000 over there. Anybody else at 2,100? Pizza, Airbnb, the Kitsap Coast. Shall I sell this then? Michael, where are you going? You going anywhere? Sold. $2,000. Nicely yeah. done. Yay! Thank you. 197. 197. Yeah. How about a round of applause for a fabulous live auction? And the lovers, you're lovers, aren't you, of wet? And I am too. I'll be back in just a moment. Miss Maggie, you're going to lead us here into the next. Yeah, well, actually, I have a surprise announcement. Oh, I, I love know. surprises. No. So normally we don't uh, do this at galas, but since you all are here tonight and we are so thankful for you, we have a surprise and we're gonna announce the first show in season 19. So in the fall of 2022, that's what year we're in, our first show of the season will be Suicide Forest by Haruna Lee. Haruna is a playwright from Seattle and tonight we have someone special here with us, our director Mimi Katano. And Mimi's going to come up and say a few words for us. So much haichu. Um, hi, my name is Mimi Katano, and I've been invited to direct here this uh, summer, fall. Um, very, very honored. Um, I'm also the executive artistic director of Youth Theatre Northwest on Marshall Island. Thank you. Our gala is very different. <laughs> very educational. <laughs> Thank you. Taking lots of notes. Um, I was asked to introduce the play so that you have a little preview. Um, like Maggie said, Suicide Forest is written by Haruna Lee. Um, it portrays a nightmare, really, um, in the underbelly of modern Japanese culture. It takes us in the mindset of an Asian American woman who is struggling to find her identity and try to mend her relationship with her father. Um, it is so painfully and beautifully specific to her own personal experience, but also it transcends culture, which is a sure sign of a masterpiece. Um, yeah. <laughs> Uh, I had a uh, pleasure uh, of meeting and speaking with Haruna a little while back uh, via Zoom, and she is a lovely person. Um, and I can't believe that she and Wet has entrusted this amazing piece of theater in my hands. Um, it is for sure a play that will stay with you after you see it, if I do it right. Um, <laughs> I am so privileged to be here and to be invited and to have this opportunities. Um, so please raise your paddle and support them deeply and heavily so I can bring this piece justice. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Mimi. We know you're gonna do an incredible job. Yeah. Is your System failure. I just kept saying <laughs> incredible over and over <laughs> into the microphone. Um, Mimi, thank you so much. You know, I think you're one of the coolest people ever and one of the first people that really took me in as a community member in Seattle theater. So it's kind of insane that we get to be full circle like this, right? Insane. Thank you. Thank you. Um, speaking of community, uh, are you ready to get your minds blown and try not to cry? Because uh, I've got a musical performance for you all. It's not me. <laughs> 
Not, th not this year, not this year. Um, but uh, we can go ahead and uh, start getting set up for this. Uh, we'll bring the very well quaffed Frank Bednarz up as our sound tech. <laughs> He didn't, he didn't know I was going to be talking about him this much on the microphone, but... Um, well, here I have uh, just, just a few friends. No big deal. Biggest deal ever. Rihanna Attendido. You may have seen her in Dance Nation. Rest in peace. <laughs> uh, we also have uh, Justin Huertas. Done a few things. Uh, I think most importantly was in a little show called Sprawl. <laughs> Our first show at 12th Avenue Arts. Oh my gosh. And uh, sorry, Justin, the love of my life, Tyler Rogers. <laughs> I love you. Um, so what's going to happen here is um, I'll let them introduce themselves more, but uh, we're about to hear an original song by Miss Rihanna Tendido. <laughs> Hi everyone, thanks so much for being here. It's so good to see faces. <laughs> this is so nice. Testing. Um, oh, they're gonna work that Amazing. stuff out. Um, but like the lovely Erin said, I am Rihanna. This is Justin, that's Tyler. When Erin and Maggie asked me to write a song about system failure, the first thing that came to mind was the state of the world. So uh, <laughs> this is a song that I wrote about the state of the world. We're going to start this over. <laughs> we were so excited. Get you get to hear that a cappella intro yeah. one more time. <laughs> I did that intentionally. <laughs> yes. Oh. Yes. This is system failure. <laughs> Shown 
is innocence betrayed, the guilty unafraid. All that we've seen is violence to no end from demons that defend. All right, thank you so much. I'm gonna. All right, that clipboard was really weighing me down. What's up? No. Uh, later. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna have a private conversation into the microphone. Uh, I feel like you all know me now. Um, I just, thank you. Um, I just wanted to say, this is truly a tripping hazard. Um, I <laughs> just wanted to say how um, thankful I am for all of you tuning in uh, on our live stream and here in person to celebrate WET. This, <laughs> it's really incredible being in a room physically with people and sharing this energy. Um, as artists, we need the energy of others to create and survive and thrive and succeed. And a lot of us have been feeling lost and pretty alone without our artistic posse. Over the past two years, we have watched our society and infrastructure crumbling around us. And while the cracks in it begin to widen and more insanity shows, it also shows us that it has never been more apparent that we need live theater. <laughs> and that we need each other. WET is a special company. We're not just a producing house. We are a community and a legacy of love. If you're a past ensemble member, will you please stand? And if you're a current ensemble member, will you wave your hand? We're all standing, but <laughs> wave your hand a little. No matter how many hard conversations that we've had about season planning or all the groans that we've shared pushing that fucking road case to our storage unit, or all the petty fights that we've had at 2 a.m. while building the risers. The love we have for each other runs deep, and I hope that you all feel that tonight. I can't tell you how excited I am to stand here knowing that we start rehearsal next Monday for the first time in two years. <laughs> two years. <laughs> for Tin Cat Shoes. 
Um, and you know, for this part in the speech, I had originally written something that was like bullshit about, you know, how I was sad that the pandemic was happening and what a challenge it's been. But I think we're all pretty sick of hearing about that. Um, so I thought we need some positivity, you feel me? Um, <laughs> and so I sat down and I really thought about what it means to me to be a part of what and why I keep coming back year after year. And the answer is this, <laughs> being able to share with my friends, collaborators in the community here and dream and get ready and excited for a company that we pour ourselves into. Aaron and I were in a meeting about our 850th meeting last week to get ready for tonight. And uh, she said something that I've been thinking about a lot. We were you know, talking about our time in leadership and how it's been going. And she said that even though it's been a wild ride, I like to think that we were here for wet when it needed us most. And this ensemble, this current iteration of all my close friends and collaborators were here to lift this company up when it needed us most. And now we need you. <laughs> we need you when we need it the most. We need you for more weird fucking plays. <laughs> your support, <laughs> your support lets us step out of the wreckage of the pandemic and into a world of success. Next season is paramount for WET. We are seeking out impossible plays to produce. We're prioritizing discomfort and we're sticking to our angsty guns. <clears throat> And your support tonight allows us to do that in the only way that WET knows how, with a smirk on our face and our community behind us. <clears throat> Thank you all so much for being here tonight and supporting this ragtag island of misfit toys. Thank you. How about a big round of applause for Maggie here? Yay, Maggie! Beautifully done, Maggie. Thank you. Come on up, Miss Erin. So during this portion of our evening, which will just take a few moments, but it's really important, we have a goal of $41,000. Isn't that something? Now, I think that's reasonable, considering a couple years ago when I was with you, um, you, 86 of you, raised your paddle during this portion of the evening and raised $44,000 plus. So we're hoping that we can uh, square away again this year and get close to that. Don't you think so? Fine women, cohorts? Uh, you know, I feel like with this group of people, we can probably yeah. crush it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and we stood on this stage two years ago and promised you a mind blowing season, and next season we're going to produce yeah. it. I mean, this so, is, yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> Things are happening. So, without further ado, we have different levels, by the way, that you can jump in at or jump in twice or three times, whatever you feel most comfortable with, Stephen. Just letting you know. The first amount that we're going to be shooting for is $5,000. Would anybody like to make a dirt? Lincoln, bitter, 189. Lincoln. 189, beautiful. <laughs> ah, nice. Sammy, are you raising your paddle on behalf of Han Hannah Victoria? Franklin? Hannah Victoria Hannah Franklin. Hannah Victoria Franklin. 305. 305. 184, Steven! Steven! 172! John Robinson! Oh, man, Joe! Get out of here! Where are the Twix bars? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, my God! Anybody, I'm not stopping now. Anybody else at $5,000? What a nice level. Oh, my God. You were thinking maybe 2,500, maybe you'll just double it. Little encouragement there. If I'm not mistaken, we're at about twenty thousand dollars now, right? My human calculator. Just Thank like you. that. Just like that. Isn't that amazing? How about a round of applause for the five thousand dollar level? Woo! Thank you. Thank you. We're well Thank on our you. way to forty-one thousand dollars. The next level is twenty-five hundred dollars. May I see a few paddles up at the very least at two thousand five hundred dollars? 
Anybody? Nicely done. Jason. One, 148. The Jasons. 148. <laughs> Beautiful. Anybody else in at 2,500? Ah, oh, isn't this nice? We're halfway to our goal, really, if you think about it. You don't have to think hard if you know how to add. Okay. <laughs> which I got a D in intermediate algebra in college. Just want you to know I've come a long way here as an auctioneer. <laughs> so, here's some good news. The next level, the names, I'm just slain by these names. Great. Winky and Peter Hussey. Fabulous. Winky, I'm changing my name to Winky. Winky and Peter Hussey couldn't be with us this evening, but they would like to kick off the $2,000 level. So put Winky and Peter in at $2,000. Thank you, Winky and Peter. And they're not even here. <laughs> they're winking and petering and hussing somewhere else. Would anybody here in the room like to raise your paddle with Winky and Peter at $2,000? Maybe even just one paddle up? Okay. Nicely done, Winky and Peter. Call them up and let them know that we appreciate them. Thank you. Or text them. The next level is $1,500. May I see a handful of paddles up at $1,500? I'll start on this side of the room. Anybody here at $1,500? People get nervous when I come close. I promise I won't do anything terrible. Nice. Yeah! <laughs> 116. Thank you, Are you Michael. Hey, Michael Castor, 116. He's going to Lake Tahoe soon. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> My mind captures the oddest things, it does. doesn't it? Anybody else over here at 1500 to balance out Michael's side? Just checking? Okay. That's okay. Just double checking. The next level, well, we're going to do a little video now, if I'm not mistaken. That was the $1,500 level. I think we are. So we've got a, a, a message from our board president, right? Our board president, Carrie Bierman. Mm -hmm. Before we go into the next level, so why don't we focus on that right now? Hey, wet supporters. I hope that everybody is enjoying the gala so far, whether you're watching in person at Block 41 or on your couch or on a screen someplace else. Um, my name is Carrie Bierman. I'm WET's board president. And I'm so excited that the ensemble put together this incredible hybrid gala so that everyone can enjoy no matter where they're feeling comfortable these days. And really, that is what I love the most about WET. They are a scrappy, courageous theater yes. company that makes a lot out of a little. And whether it is digital productions like we've had to do for the past couple of years or in-person live theater productions, I know that whenever I go see a wet show, it's going to be a little weird. It's going to be wonderful. It's going to be like nothing I've ever seen before. But most importantly, it's going to make me think differently about myself and the world around me. And that is what I love so much about this theater company and why I have been a supporter for so many years. So I encourage you all to give what you can tonight. I'm going to be raising my paddle at the thousand dollar level. Yay, and I Karen. hope that there are some folks out there who are going to join me so that we can make sure that uh, the Washington Ensemble Theater can be a part of the Seattle community, providing this awesome art for folks for the foreseeable future. So I hope everybody enjoys the rest of the gala. And I really can't wait to see everybody back in the theater where we have our first in-person live production of Tin Cat Shoes on April 15th. I'm so excited, and I can't wait to see you there. Enjoy the rest of the night. Thank you, Carrie. Carrie for president. Oh, she already is president. OK. Bye, Carrie. Nice. Carrie's kicking us off at $1,000. We love you, Carrie. Beautifully done. Now, here's the good news. We have a couple other folks who couldn't be with us, including Brent Johnson. He would also like to give us $1,000. Thank you, Brent. Thank, Thank you, Brent. Brent. Very nice. And another lovely couple, Michael and Woody Lockman, would also like to give $1,000. Beautifully done. Thank Pretty you. Pretty good. Now, anybody else in this room, would you like to give $1,000? Beautiful. 183, thank you kindly. Thank Two you, Peter and zero Nicole. Nicole and Devin. 208, Pete, thank, thank you. you. 174, thank you, sir. I thank appreciate you. Thank you, Pete. Anybody else over there at a grand? $1,000. Oh, I'm going over there. Yep, you got it. I'm coming. What? Han Hannah again. She says she wants to give another thousand. Yay, another thousand. <laughs> another Hannah. thousand dollars. <laughs> Keep her on the line. <laughs> Yay, what? Sammy. For, from oh my you, gosh. right, Sammy? Sammy. Sammy. But 
that's, isn't that Hannah's number? Okay, okay. Thousand for Hannah. Thousand for Hannah. Nicely done. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you kindly. 197. Kelsey. Thank you, Kelsey. In Hannah's honor. Beautiful. Former ensemble member, right? <laughs> Beautifully done. 197. Anybody else in at $1,000? Okay, now what, think about it, and I'm going to go over here to my fabulous volunteer who's um, keeping a running total. And can you just kindly show me where we're at? Get the clapping going. Woo! Yeah. How much? Anybody want to hide you? $35,000. We're at $35,000. Nicely done. You look so we have about 6,000 left, and um, I think we're well on our way. So here's the good news. Bennett Hitchcock, Hitchcock's Lane is not with us, big supporter. Would like to match dollar for dollar 10 pedals up at the $500 level. So if we get 10 pedals up at $500 each, then Bennett here is going to throw in another five grand. You got that, sister? Just letting you know. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> so here we go. You help me count, okay? Yes. Maybe just right. with your finger dings or okay. something. Okay, here we go. Bitter one, one, two. Thank you. Bitter two, one, seven. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bitter one, forty-eight. Thank you. Thank you. I have you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, one eighty-one. Thank you kindly. Thank you all so much. Is that four? That's four. Thank you. Thank you, Bitter, Corinne. Uh, Lincoln's table, two. One eight, thank yeah. you very much. Halfway. 500. <laughs> Nicely done. So we have, we need five more. Thank you. One sixty six. Thank Woo! you. Four more, and then we get to put in another five grand. Four more up at five hundred. Keep it, keep it going. Keep it going. Yeah, come on. Can I see four more paddles up? Anybody in? Paddles up. Hey! Nice. Yeah. Lincoln, 189. Thank you. Thank you, Three Lincoln. more up. Three more at 500 each. Dollar for dollar. We take payment plans here at WET. <laughs> if they may, right? Absolutely. Anybody else in? Three more, and then we can throw in another five grand. Isn't that amazing? You give 500, we got five grand. How's that for, for the map? Three that's why more. I got the, that's why I got the D. Woo! 190! Thank you. 190! Two more! Two more! I know, it seems painful, but it's fun. It's, <laughs> I am sick in that way. This is good tension. I like this. Because look at who we're raising money for. You know what I mean? Anybody else in? We need two more paddles up at $500 each. I would love to see somebody else jump in or somebody who came in earlier. Or if one person wants to give a grand, then we've got that other 5,000 coming our way. Anybody in right now? Pedal up. Okay, we can't put the 5,000 in until we get two more. Ooh, how about a little drum roll, please? Anybody else in? Raise the paddle, raise the paddle. Okay, how about this? Let's go ahead and put in um, 4,000 extra. From, from Mr. Bennett's co you his, got his it. contribution. Mm -hmm. That's doable. So we'll match 4,000. And in the course of the next few moments, if you decide to come in at 500, we'll get that other 1,000 from Bennett. Yeah. How's that sound? <gasps> oh, beautiful. Woo! 197. Kelsey! 197 for is going to get 500. 500. <laughs> we need one more paddle Thank up. Thank you, Kelsey. A little more volume, please. One more paddle up at 500, and then one Bennett's more. five grand. Anybody else in at 500? I'm sweating. I'm too. Nice. Stevens, Steven! thank God. Oh! And you, sister. Miss Steven. One, Miss, Miss Stern, or do you have your own last name? I appreciate that. Jennifer yes. Dice. We're not the property of other people. Isn't that nice? 184 is the last. Steven. The, Steven Stern and his lovely spouse, who has her own fabulous last name. <laughs> We're modern here. You're gonna make me I like cry. being modern. Yeah. You know? <laughs> okay, how fabulous is that? That was five grand on the floor, and then that was a five thousand dollar match. That was an additional ten thousand right there. Beautifully done. Now we're in the home stretch here. Let's go around the room. At two hundred and fifty dollars, I'll be with you in one moment. I'm starting over here at two hundred and fifty dollars. A direct cash contribution right here to wet. Anybody else in? Okay, coming around. 
Still seeing you over here. Anybody here at 250? Nice. Yeah. 147. Beautifully done. Thank you. Anybody Thank you, else Kristen. at 250? Excellent. Okay. The next level then is $100. Anybody in at 100? $100? 192. Thank you, sir. Thank you, 156. Yeah. Thank you, 170 and 137. Thank you. 219. Thank you, and 105. Thank, thank you very you. much for the $100. Up, oh, my little windbreaker fell off, my little ball here. I tend to lose my ball every now and again when I get excited. <laughs> Anybody else in at $100? That's why it's sounding funny. I was wondering why. Mm. Anybody else at, excellent, Woo! 185. Thank you kindly, 185 and 187. Yeah. Hip, hip, hooray. Dylan. It's a $100 level. All right, the next level is $50. Anybody in at 50? It's a final wrap, 149, thank you. 171, thank you. 108, thank you. Thank you. 104, thank you. 128, thank, thank you. you Jeff. 102, thank you. 195, thank you. 151, thank you. <laughs> 175, thank, thank you. you. 198, beautifully done. 134, thank you. <laughs> thank, you. thank you, 142. Woo, it's $100 thank you. Level. Thank, thank you, you thank so you. much. $50, excuse me, the $50 level. Anybody else in at 50? Okay. That's like one Uber Eats. Is that night? Amazing. <laughs> okay. Can we have the, the full ensemble come up? Our, our, all of our folks here. Can we have some of my babies? Come on up, everybody. We've got one more level. And come if you on wanna up, wet. Grab the whiskey in a minute. Yes, get up okay. here. Come on up, the ensemble. We want to see everybody. We want to see your beautiful faces. Who will... The next level, I don't know where they are. There you are, Kiki, is representing. It's just Kiki. Okay, it's Kiki, just for Kiki, there's more people, we promise. It's not all an illusion, but that's okay. They're a little shy. It's a shy crowd. Well, here we go. Oh, here we, here we are. Nice. Excellent. The We're mother... a small but mighty group tonight. Left the wedding early. Ben left the wedding early. Okay, here we go, folks. The next level is $25, and this will be it. Maybe there's one more. We'll see. Anybody in at $25? Thank you, 156. Beautifully done, and 160. Thank you. Anybody else at 25? The next level is 25. Anybody else in? I see you, 197. Thank you. Ignore that. Anybody else in at one? I have you 197. Nicely done. Okay. Anybody else in at $25? Okay. How about a round of applause for yourselves? You stay here, ensemble. Now we're going to keep the $50 up, and what we're going to do is a, a, a final round here, and tell us about what it is, Miss Erin, that uh, we're going to uh, raise our paddles for. And the last paddle up, we'll get this beautiful bottle of. Oh, you mean this bulletproof bottle of Macallan 12 in my <laughs> hand? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty attractive. It says uh, <laughs> single malt scotch whiskey. Yeah, nice. Ever heard of it? So how's this going to work, Laura? So this is how it's going to work. You're going to simply raise your paddle if you'd like it. And then if the next person raises their paddle, they're uh, basically, I don't use the word Trump, but they have pushed you aside. How's that? So... We won't ever say that word again. So raise your paddle, and then what we'll do is uh, the, last, the last paddle up um, gets the bottle. But the thing is, every time you raise your paddle, you're making a contribution. Sometimes somebody thinks, oh, I'm going to keep raising my paddle because it's not over. But every time you raise your paddle, it's $50 well spent. Okay? So here we go. Who would like this beautiful bottle of whiskey? 185. 185 is kicking us off. 185 gets the bottle unless somebody else comes in. Anybody else in? Oh, 181, thank you. 174, you're in 174. Last call then, maybe. Anybody else in at 50? 148 and 137. 137 still has the bottle. This is it. Anybody else in? This is $50 paddle raise for a beautiful bottle of whiskey. Thank you. I see you 185 and 148 again. Thank you. Anybody else in? Stephen, double check it. Lincoln, where's Lincoln? 148 again. Nicely done. Thank you. Okay, shall I, shall I give this bottle then to 148? One. Oh, one. 
183 and 185, thank you. Excellent. 185, 183, I have you earlier. I'm, you don't have to write that down again. <laughs> Just repeating myself. Anybody else in it? I see you, 148 really wants the bottle. Okay, 148. I'm coming over here, 148. The bottle doesn't break, that's the good news. Now listen, cuties. Bulletproof. <laughs> Give me 500 and I'll stop the game. What? Give me 500 bucks and I'll stop the game. Okay. Yes? Yeah. And it's yours. Sold, $500. Nicely done. <laughs> Bitters, 148. 148. Poof. Nice. You gotta cut the deal and just let it go. Thank you, Jason. Nice. How about a big round of applause for yourselves, folks? Beautiful. Now I'm gonna get a total. Okay, what's our total? How much? Can I just see it written down? 46,000, 40, hold on, $47,025. How about a round of applause? 6,000 past our goal. Yay! <laughs> How about a big round of applause for you beauties? Of course, thank you all so much. On behalf of everybody up here. I'm gonna let you wrap it up with the raffle. My name is Laura Mahalik. Thank you for getting me out of the house. Thank you. Laura. Thank you. Thank you very much, everybody. Oh, Thank it. you for your <laughs> generosity. And I think we're going to do the raffle. Oh, yeah, we got the raffle. Okay, and then we you're going to say goodnight. And the, uh, we have one more yes, performance. Which I love. One more performance. It's going to be... Maggie and Aaron, beautifully done. Thanks no, to thank the both you. of you. How about we a big round of applause for these two job, beauties? Laura. Nice. I love listening and also to you. We're not worthy. <laughs> and shout out to our tech team who put up with nice. a lot of crazy bullshit today. So, woo! All right. So, as you all have heard, Tin Cat Shoes opens April 15th. And we have two cast members in the house. We have Kiki Abba. Our director of communications. <laughs> I know what everybody does in this company, okay? God damn it. And we also have whose birthday it is today. It's Steven. <laughs> and Glow Alcala. All right, so. Happy birthday, Gloria. I feel like <clears throat> since, oh, I'm joking. I'm sorry. I fucking hate when people do that to me. I don't know why I just did it. Tickets, so. All right, so now Glow, who is Gemma in Tin Cat Shoes, is pulling the winner of the raffle and standing right in front of Kiki. We are on camera. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Seven of spades. Yeah! <laughs> yes, came up here. What's the bitter number? What's the bitter number? 195. That's you. Congratulations. What yeah, what do they win, Aaron? You're going to Capitol Hill Block Party! <laughs> VIP! <laughs> Can you believe it? I can't, I'll be shaking my booty to Charlie XCX right next to you. Yes! I... Now you wish you got the Capitol Hill Block, block Party tickets. Thank you we... so much. <laughs> Thank you so much. No, do you don't want any? Do you want to All right, now. It's just us co-conspirating. We're it's like, just do you us. want to introduce the last performer or should I? Just the two. We Let's try to together. do it at the same time. Okay. Our oh, next nice performance, performance is, is by, by the, the little the, Ed. Uh, it's over. Working. It's not yeah. working. Our next performers are also going to be our featured choreographers for our upcoming remount of Reset. Woo! In person, live and in person, on the set of Tin Cat Shoes. Can you even? I cannot. 
You all better get hype for Dandy. Here they come. Hello. Okay, great, yes. Oh my God. Wait, just put it on. Are you guys having a good time or no? <laughs> This is just a little ditty we made for y'all. So I hope you like it. It's a little something Listen sweet. Dandy candy, sweet like a lollipop. Supple like some licorice and hard like a lemon drop. All up in your mouth like a pack of fucking pop rocks. Booty, booty bouncing. We not talking about a TikTok. TikTok. Time's up for all of you lazy bitches. Dandy making magic double trouble. You can call us twitches, which gets me to my next point. What? We are not cheap. Please run that coin. We smooth like some chocolate that melts in your mouth. We do it with integrity and never for the cloud. Ooey gooey, nice and chewy like a motherfucking gummy bear. Everywhere I Isha goes, you know the boys are gonna stare. Dandy, we sweet like candy. I know you want more. We're not talking about Mandy. Dandy, we sweet like candy. I know you want more. We're not talking about Mandy. Staring at Aisha like she the Mona Lisa. I get the dicks excited, looking like the Tower of Pisa. I lick that pussy bar like the Zora Milaje. And if you're lucky, Dandy might just give you a menage. Triple threat, so you know that you gazing at the stars. In a stellar artist. Next up, we gon' curate on the Mars. Neptune, then the the moon we shine blinding all you hoes as we match the speed of light you know we keep that thing juicy you can keep the pedia light no need for doja neither we stay high off life d money sweet like honey such a delight like sunny and you know we all night like the energizer bunny that's dandy, dandy. we sweet like candy i know, I know you want more we're, we're not, not talking about mandy dandy we sweet like candy, candy. I, know I know you want, you want more, more. Let's do the three in the morning and a run around noon Cause I want a fat ass I don't want no fucking doom and gloom Abs on flat and my pussy on gushy I'm just kidding, bitch, I'm shy So don't be getting pushy Not for real, hit my line up And we can do this now and later Take your time and let me save it Tell me what's your favorite flavor Mouth be causing battles Cause I got that fucking warhead Sweet and sour kisses with an appetite So keep me fed Dandy, we sweet like candy I know you want more We're not talking about Mandy Dandy, we sweet like candy I know you you want more, we not talking about man. Now gonna eat it like you in the kitchen. Lick that spoon and do them dishes. No 30 minute meals, promise no malnutrition. Set the time for 90 minutes with no intermission. I'll be a dominatrix, so go to full submission. We stay sweet, no cavities. Keep it cute, no raggedy. We flossing, we glossing. Working from home, we bossing. Better proceed us with caution because you know we costing. No imitation chocolate melting right through your pocket. Dandy, sweet like candy. I know you want more, we not talking about Mandy. Dandy. We sweet like candy. I know you want more. We're not talking about Mandy. <laughs> D Money and Aisha. <laughs> Bonnet Black. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Give it up for Dandy again! Oh my god! <laughs> well, <laughs> it's a terrible ending. What's up, everyone? Um, thank you all so much for being here tonight. Um, I know it. <clears throat> it was bonkers. It was bonkers. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We appreciate you all so much. And we can't wait to see you in April for 10 Cat Shoes! This felt like the wildest, craziest, and like most drunk reunion I've ever been to. So let's continue. See you in April. Woo! That's a wrap. Yeah. I don't know. We should keep doing ending lines. <laughs> Love you all so Thank much. Thank you all. What loves you? Grab a drink. We love you. Mwah. We love you all. Look at all the money in the building.